go to the uh, next part, right? Uh, that mean uh, losses with the disposal cost. Losses with the disposal cost. Same as the uh, previous question. The previously we had disposal uh, gain, or we can say scrap values, right? When we have a loss, right? When we have a waste stage, that unit we can sell to the outside and we can earn an income. Now what we do is here. There may be some process to dispose that our waste stage. We need to incur another ad, uh, addition, or we can say, we need to incur another expense as well. At that time, how we can prepare accounts, right? Same scenario. I will show you an example, right? Here you have given that input to process was thousand units, right? Ekaga daahak diila tamai nish process ke ani at a cost of uh, four thousand. Yeah, it should be 40, 000, uh, 45,000, right? There is a mistake. 45,000. Normal loss is again 10% and there is no opening or closing inventories. Actual output was uh, 860 units and loss uh, units had to be disposed at a cost of 0.9, that means 90 cents per unit. And and now, if you look at this, it will be expensive to pay for this. It will be expensive to pay for this. If you look at this, you will be able to pay for this. You will be able to pay for this. If you look at this scrap, you will be able to pay for this. If you look at this, you will be able to pay for this. You will be able to pay for this. Then, you will be able to pay for this. Then, you will be able to pay for this. Then, you will be able to pay for this. Then, you will be able to pay for this. बाहर करने तब बहर करने आना कोटा बाहर पास कर देने आना कोटा तब बहर करने आना कोटा भी आप आ रहे हैं आप इतना तवत छतानुओं का एक का यूनिट टेकर छतानुओं का विदंग कराने में राइट ए वे लावे को होने की नुमतियां निकलता में में तो नहीं कहता करने राइट इतना और में तो पेन और कालिंग वगैरह में तो माय Previously, when we have income, what we did was here we adjusted that amount to the material cost. Now, what will happen? We need to adjust that disposal cost to the again to the uh, material cost. But previously, you deducted it from the material cost. Now, you are going to add that cost to the material cost, right? The material cost is here. Yes, 45,000. Here, you can see that for you have added the disposal cost to the material cost. Then same as the previous, you can deduct, uh, you can divide it from the expected outcome. Api vyapar in a nishpari process ek expected outcome make a bedanama mukad the material cost plus a wastage givat karanyana cost taker ekatukar. Right? Then you can calculate the cost per unit. With that again you can prepare the process account, process account, right? I will show you uh, how you, they have done this thing. Right. Okay. Here, cost of input they have mentioned uh, units thousand. The amount is forty five thousand. Right. There is a mistake. This should be forty five thousand. And when it's come to the uh, output, here again, again they have mentioned that exact output eight hundred sixty units. Eight hundred sixty units. Right. Here you can take the uh, output value. Right. Then, uh, since you have calculated the cost per unit, you can multiply it by and take the value, right? You can multiply and take the value. And normal loss, yes, we had 1000 units and normal loss is 10 percent. That means normal loss is 100, same as the previous one, right? Normal loss is 100. Apart from that, now you need to think this part. To dispose that normal loss, you need to incur another 90 cents per unit. पीरी व्यय तो मुकदमे में आपे आय मत इनपुट साइड देख रहे ना नॉर्मल लॉस से के डिस्पोज करने आना पीरी व्यय राइट है ना नामसी या ताय मत प्रोसेस अकाउंट के डेबिट साइड देख रहे ना तो हम मुकदमे आपे पीरी व्यय तवात वैडी है ना एंड एब्नोमल लॉस से का तीनों कि ये द आपे नामसी ये एक्सपेक्ट करे है then you can balance this account, right? That's how you need to do this uh, process account and sim similarly, you can prepare the abnormal loss account as well, right? Abnormal loss account, you can credit process account and debit abnormal loss account 
and again disposal cost again you need to take here right you can uh, debit abnormal loss account this one and that total amount you can consider that as a statement of profit or loss you can total amount you can charge to the profit and loss right abnormal loss okay ena balamu api kohomada abnormal loss account ekak hadanne kiyala abnormal loss account ekak kalin wagema thamai process account ekak hadana wath ekkama hadagena yanna puluwam right abnormal loss credit to the process account and debit to the abnormal loss account and also you need to take this uh, disposal cost apita ekaka hataliyak api ayin karana kiyadda atasi namasiya ek expect kara atasi hatai actual output ekena ena abnormal loss ekak hataliyak thiyena ena e hatalita adala cost ekak api mena metanta abnormal loss account ekak dana ekaka hataliyak satanuwa gane piya 360 then total you can charge to the profit and loss total you can charge to the profit and loss right we demak kiyana adura ganna pulu that's what you need to do right හොඳයි එන අපි මේ වෙනකන් කතා කරේ කොහොමද පෙර සැරි ගිනුම් කරන්නේ නැත්නම් පෙර සැරි පිරිවැයකරණයේදී අපි ගිනුම් හදන්නේ ඒ වගේම ගණන් හදන්නේ කියලා අපි මේ වෙනකන් කතා කරා කොහොමද පෙර සැරි ගිනුම් හදනකොට අපි මූලික අමුද්‍රව්‍ය ශ්‍රම පිරිවැය සහ මේ වෙනකොට අපි අඳුරගෙන තියෙන ප්‍රොඩක්ෂන් ඕවර්හෙඩ්ස් පොදු කාර්ය වීදා නිෂ්පාදන පොදු කාර්ය වීදා අඳුරගෙන කොහොමද අපි නිෂ්පාදිතයේ වටිනාකම ගණනය කරන්නේ කියලා. ඒ වගේම කොහොමද මේ process account එක වෙනස් වෙන්නේ? අපේ normal loss එක සහ abnormal loss එක සාමාන්‍ය අපතය, අසාමාන්‍ය අපතය සහ abnormal gain එකක් තියෙන වෙලාවට. ඒ වගේම ඊට පස්සේ අපි කතා කරා කොහොමද scrap value එක. සුම්බුන් අගයක් තියෙනකොට අපි ගිනුම් තියන්නේ කියලා සහ ඒ අදාළ ගිනුම් පිළියෙල කරන්නේ සහ ආදායම් ප්‍රකාශයට ආදායම් වියදම් හඳුන ගන්නේ කොහොමද කියලා මේ වෙනකොට කතා කරලා තියෙනවා. අන්තිමටම අපි කතා කරේ කොහොමද මේ පෙර සැරි ගිනුම් හදනකොට අපි ගවතින ස්ක්‍රැප්ස් නැත්නම් අපි ගවතින මේ ලොස් වෙච්ච යුනිට්ස් අපි ඩිස්පෝස් කරනකොට ඉවත් කරනකොට දරන පිරිවැය කොහොමද මේ ගිනුම් තුල ගලපන්නේ කියලා. That's all about the process costing, right? Uh, so far we have discussed how we can prepare process accounts and how we can recognize the material cost, labor cost and other production overheads when we are preparing these uh, process accounts, right? And apart from that we discussed about uh, how we can uh, recognize scrap values. in these uh, process accounts right when we are have normal loss or when we have abnormal loss right and also when we have a scrap value for those loss right how we can prepare process accounts and also we discuss about when we have a disposal cost when we are disposing the uh, normal loss and abnormal loss uh, units right uh, how we can adjust that uh, abnormal loss and uh, ab uh, normal loss and disposal cost right how we can adjust those things within the process account and uh, this is what uh, we expected to do during this session and hope you will uh, get the most of it and with that we can wind up session thank you